While it's important to consider what a new tool will be able to aid you and your students with, it's perhaps even more important to maintain a clear vision of what needs to be accomplished from a curriculum and pedagogy standpoint. If we start from the goals and objectives, then technology can come alongside our design. Considering the tool first could narrow the scope of what is possible. To illustrate, let's talk through a hypothetical teaching and learning situation where we would want to use an appropriate active learning strategy. We will consider how we might approach using Google Classroom to aid learning, evaluate how effective it is at its job, and then determine if we need to employ additional tools to complement or replace Google Classroom in order to accomplish our goals. Let's say that I'm introducing new content in today's lesson. I want to engage students in a background knowledge probe to let them consider what they already know so that they are ready to integrate new knowledge into their existing schema. I want to prompt learners to activate their thinking. Because this is new content, I want the interaction to be in class rather than online. I feel I'll have a better pulse on student thinking in this environment, with them in the room with me. And we can address concerns at the moment of need. Through experience, I know there's a lot of clarifying questions that get asked in the activation part of a lesson. Google Classroom, and most LMS formats for that matter, are quite useful for asynchronous online communication. But instead, my intention is for a snappy interaction with quick exchanges together in class. So, I plan to use a background knowledge probe completely face-to-face -face as my active learning strategy. But to immediately display the student responses, I need some sort of student response system. Can Google Classroom help me with this? If not, will I have to train my students to use yet another tool? A student response system I'm thinking would be useful in this situation is Pear Deck. This is a much more conducive tool for creating an in-class background knowledge probe. As a bonus, it is connected to the Google suite of apps, so students can use their existing Google accounts. All I need to do is set up a session for the students, point them to PearDeck.com, give them the session code, and they are on their way with no training needed. So think about Pear Deck or your student response system of choice when you're planning a face-to-face -face background knowledge probe. 